Coach, your thoughts on the four-game sweep of North Dakota? Uh, it's always nice, Jonah, to win four games. Um, the biggest thing was that we didn't play well, yet we managed to find ways to win. Um, and that's the trademark of good teams. You, you know, sometimes you don't play well, but you do whatever it takes to win. Um, and we did that in three out of the four games. 8-0 and start in conference. Better than 0-8. So we're, we're, we're happy to be 8-0, but we know that still a lot of games left. You know, there's 20 games left, so a lot can happen in those 20 games. We just need to keep working. Uh, we need to keep uh, getting better. And we just need to understand that uh, the game can change at any moment. So it's nice to be 8-0. It's better than 0-8, but we still have a lot of work to do. And now a 17-1 record at home as well. You know what, That's we need to start uh, creating that tradition at home where this is a tough place to come in and, and, and play for the visiting team. Um, and this group is beginning to get that tradition. I think if you look around the country, uh, a lot of the better programs uh, have that at home where it's, it's a big advantage. They play well there. Um, visiting teams find it difficult to go in there and win. So we're slowly uh, beginning to turn that around. And, you know, 17-1 and one is pretty darn good. And you're now entering your final matchup with UT Brownsville. Yes, tomorrow night, uh, final game between us and UTB. Um, obviously, their kids, uh, you know, playing our kids are always uh, they're always motivated. Uh, you know, they want to be, uh, you know, beat the Division One. Our kids hopefully understand that uh, you know it's again a home game. We need to protect our turf, um, and we need to play well. So we're looking forward to it.